vlogging from the kitchen today. I just made cornbread and I have sweet potatoes in the oven and some ribs in the oven. I laid out some hamburger to make Salisbury steak tomorrow. Dad just went and took a ride with the dog and to check my P.O. box. And I have 80s music going, although I have it paused right now. So I don't get the whole copyright infringement thing going on. What is today? Today is Saturday, the 20th? Yeah, the 20th. I am not getting near any kind of mall, store, or anything today because this weekend is going to be crazy with those last minute shoppers. This is the last shopping weekend before the big Christmas. Um, this morning has been a little bit of a bummer. Uh, Dad. When I got up, I heard Dad on the phone, and I could tell somebody had died. You know, you hear that conversation, so I went to the restroom and came back out. And I and he was off the phone, and he's like, my buddy Ned Whitmire passed away. We'd just been talking about Ned the other day, and um, he, he had cancer. He, t he was talking to his friend Smitty, who had been going over to see Ned every day, and then he went yesterday at 12.30 and uh, Ned had passed away at noon. Um, he, had, he had had cancer and they had hospice in their house. And then my grandma just called a little while ago and said, Cindy, ages ago I said, uh, um, I had somebody who had ca brain cancer and it traveled through her body and the last few months um, she's just gone downhill really fast. She's in her 50s, early 50s, I think. And, um, I saw her mom at the Legion on Thursday, because Thursday we had soup night. I did film, but on my flip camera. Um, so I do have some of that footage. You'll see one day. But, uh, I asked her mom how she was doing, and they're like, it's just a day at a time. They don't know. This week she went unresponsive where she didn't talk. And she just kind of laid there and um, she passed away this morning, uh, which is sad. She's somebody who used to always, they were always at her holiday dinners and, um, you know, uh, she had cancer quite a few years ago and beat it. And then this time it kind of beat her. So it's been a little bit of a bummer, but... And especially right at the holidays. So sad. It was nice seeing everybody at the Legion on Thursday. I hadn't been, and I haven't been to the Legion in a long time, people. And everybody was so happy to see me come. And I got so many hugs and so many, it's so good to see us. And I, um, it was nice seeing everybody. And, uh, I even get on, I even got in on the line of, uh, putting the bags together, I was the orange person. Yeah. Put an orange in the bag, move it along. Put an orange in the bag, move it along. <laughs> so, um, yeah. That was fun. Uh, then we went and saw a few Christmas lights that night. And, uh, stopped by here, got Heidi and took her out and showed her some Christmas lights too, because Heidi has to see Christmas lights too. Then the cat... She has chewed uh, through the electrical cord for the Christmas lights twice. Dad has had to splice it twice. So now she's not allowed in the house when we're not here. And if we are here, we have to watch her. If she if she's in the bed in my room sleeping, if she gets up and leaves the room, we'll say, Dad, the cat's leaving the room. So he knows to um, watch her. <laughs> He's like... She was only in five minutes that one day and I wasn't paying attention. She chewed right through, right next door. She chewed that cord before. <laughs> yeah, but I think she's been yelled at enough near the tree that she's scared to go near it. But we'll see if nobody's around to yell at her. Of course, we don't leave her in here now. We, uh, <laughs> she's a weirdo. I have all, I'm trying to get the rest of my Disney foot. I know y'all are sick of my vacation footage. I know. I could tell because it doesn't get many views. I, I, I'm i putting it on there for certain people who want me to and for myself. So I have it on there. But um, I have about four videos left from Disney. Who's calling? 
Larry, he's probably calling to say he heard that Cindy passed away. And about... And I have two from the aquarium that we went to in Sarasota and two from the jungle garden at Sarasota and like two others going to lunch with Katie and then coming home. So six, I have like 10 more videos. I'm trying people. I really am. I'm hoping to get it all up before the end of the year. So next year I will just start vlogging. I'll be vlogging more once I get all this up. It was my first vacation since 2012. So give me a break. Uh, I want to go again. I'd go to Disney again. I would just like going to the lodge I was at. I love the Wilderness Lodge. It was awesome. So nice people. Such nice people. So, today we're just going to hang around the house because we don't want to get out into the crazy shopping people and uh, cooking. I might start my cross stitch at the Angie's got me. I was going to start like yesterday and I didn't. I might start it today. I haven't done a cross stitch since I was probably in my teens. Maybe early 20s. Probably late teens. I used to cross stitch a lot when I was younger. I used to enter stuff in the fair. But I haven't done it in so long. I used to have like a, a basket that had all my little flosses in it and needles and that basket's got to be somewhere in the basement. I have projects in there I haven't finished, I know. Um, my brain just totally blanked out right then. Yes, it did. All right, I'm going to roll out, waiting for Dad to get home from the post office. I think he's going to bring, no, he's not going to bring me a sweet tea. He asked me if I wanted one, and I said no. Shocking, I know. I said, I'll just have a water. Just having a water. All right, I'm going to roll out. I'll probably put this up here soon. It is 1.30 and then maybe load a Disney one later on tonight. Okay, bye.